good Friday morning. Hopefully my camera's cleared up enough. It was quite frosty a minute ago because it's already extremely humid outside. I believe we're still in a heat advisory until 7 o'clock tonight. So my phone was in the house, so of course it fogged up when I came out. Anyway, I just want to show a couple of things. This is going to be a slightly more um, uplifting video than the last couple I've made. Uh, so let me start with this little cabin. I want to show you this. Okay, right now it's a hot mess. It's been stored since, oh, uh, let's see, my father passed away in 1997. He made an exact replica of his cabin that he built for my mother in the country. And it's just the back of the thing. Um, it's just some junk piled on it. Anyway, my sister was going to throw it to the road. She didn't want it anymore. She's lived in my mom and dad's house for the past 30 some years. And she thought this was just taking up space in the garage. Well, whatever. I said, oh no, give it to me. I want it. It's all, it's got like lights in the roof and everything. I can't really move. It's very heavy, like well constructed. It's not just thin plywood. And my dad put a lot of time and effort into it. So anyway, it's all wired with lights and everything in the roof. Um, in the ceiling it's got the little steps because my mom and dad helped me um, go back to school at one point and so they added actually an upper part onto their cabin so that my girls could spend the summer with them uh, while I was going back to school so uh, the whole upstairs was for my girls so this little cabin means a lot to me as you can imagine my mother hand sewed the little curtains um, it's got linoleum in it from their actual camper or cab, camper, sorry, I'm camper person, cabin, and it's got all the rooms that he had built. So it's an exact replica. I don't think it's to scale or anything. Anyway, my project is going to be, I've got to tote this down to my, um, down to Black Rock, uh, set it on the table and wipe it all down today and start getting some of the cobwebs off of it and the mouse poo poo. Anyway, I'm going to redo that with, um, I'm going to set it up and redo it with, um, Little doll furniture. I thought it'd be fun to start collecting little tiny doll furniture, you know, that you see like in the Hobby Lobbies and just kind of fix it up. I hope I can find rocking chairs like my parents had. My second project is my little sign up here. Oh, please excuse my mess. I do not live this messy normally. They, we just unloaded all of our stuff from the city. So I've got stuff everywhere. I've got laundry hanging over there. I just have my coffee. Um, my water jugs are all sitting here. My mother's plants are sitting there. An old bamboo shade, all kinds of stuff. Roofing for our barn. Everything's sitting here, right? I haven't had a chance yet to get it all put back up. I will, I will. But so anyway, let me tell you, hi, you can see me in the reflection. So anyway, my project's gonna be the word vagabond up there. What I'd like to do is put my ladder up there and get up there and scrub all of that mold and mildew off and then take a picture of this script and get the measurements of these letters and I'd like to have the word the and which printed. There's a store not terribly far from here where they do signs and um, they'll do that kind of plastic laminate type peel and stick type stuff. So all I got to do is go down and order the and which and then my camper will be the Vagabond Witch out front, which I thought would be kind of fun. Uh, even though I call it Bohemian Rhapsody, I still want to do that. And then over here, uh, Pepe's Memorial Park. Um, my husband wants one of those uh, little fire pits, a little fancy little fire pit. We're terribly close to the end of our driveway, but I, <laughs> I have so many signs out front now saying, don't come up here. Ugh. Um, I don't think I'm, we're going to be bothered anymore. I don't think. So anyway, he wants a little fire pit here. And I want a little rainbow park. I want Peppy's Memorial Park here. So look what I found to make his rainbow bridge out of. Um, these are rungs, or whatever you call them. Rails, rung, rungs, I, guess. I don't know what you call them. Whatever goes underneath your mattress. Uh, this was on my guest bed. And I did donate the bed. But... <laughs> I was like, ooh, those are perfect. <laughs> so I didn't, I didn't exactly donate all of it. But, you know, somebody gets a free bed and all they have to do is replace those three boards. Um, but I thought I could cut those up 
and paint each uh, part of the ladder, each little piece. I thought I could cut it maybe into 12 and each little piece with a different color, acrylic, and then, you know, seal it uh, with a polyurethane and make a little bridge out here. I thought how fun would that be to have a little colorful bridge out here. And then the trail, of course, is gonna go from Peppy's little Memorial Park here where all the lavender is gonna be planted. Now, of course, it looks shady right now, but we plan to cut down trees. Um, I have a cement mold that makes a, a, a sidewalk a section at a time. And I thought how fun would it be to dye that cement different rainbow colors. I looked it up online last night and you can order any color of the rainbow for your cement and you just mix it up one section at a time and then just lay it up. And I want the colorful sidewalk to kind of go up that way a little ways up to Strawberry Hill, which would be back there. So those are my plans. So those are my projects um, to do the little cabin, to do the vagabond words that I showed you earlier. The Vagabond Witch and clean all that up to create the little bridge with the colorful rungs or whatever. I don't know what you call pieces of a lat of a bridge. I don't know, whatever. Uh, and do it all in different colors and then create a little rainbow sidewalk that goes up to Strawberry Fields, Strawberry Hill. So that's it. That's what I'm planning on doing. That's where I'm putting my energy now is into all of that. Oh, look, there's a rainbow. I hopefully you guys can see it. There's already a rainbow showing for my little dog. Oh, hopefully you guys can see that. I don't know, when I watch this, I'll see if that shows. All right, y'all, peace out, blessed be.